This is Bottles. Hey, it's, it's your boy Pete. Here it, to play it. Get right. It. Everybody, it, here we go. Oh, uh, yeah. All right. Anyway. What the fuck? I can see orbs out the window. Wait a minute. What? Look at the TV again. Are this supposed to be? There oh, are okay, the speakers. It looked like they like didn't render the screen in the TV right. Oh, like, like it was popping out from the sides. That's funny. But their speak, you can see the indents, the speakers. But I was like, what the fuck? Did they did they fuck up in Kakarot? Oh my god! Can I go upstairs? No. Why not? What's in this box? <laughs> Porn. Wow. <laughs> the, the the fucking shoe box is just a fucking anal plug. Goodness. <laughs> you want to see something funny? I'm gonna walk around a little bit in here, and then I'm gonna go out here, and I'm gonna be like, ah! Anyway. I always love when you, when, we, when one of us yells and we just hear like a door open somewhere else in the house, they're just like, oh my god. And what's up, they hurt Where are we going? Oh, we gotta go to... Alright. I gotta drown myself. <laughs> go to I gotta West go City. find lunch. Oh yeah, I could use that. I can write about it. No, no, not it's, what I mean. It's ten o'clock at night. It's time for lunch. No, <laughs> Toriyama's just like I've eaten lunch three times today. What is happening? <laughs> How about lunch, Toyotaro? Come on, I'm full. I'm full. <laughs> no, not lunch, lunch. I can't what eat another bite. I can't eat another grilled cheese, please. <laughs> That's all he eats for lunch. It's grilled cheeses. <laughs> it's like the scene from Wrecker Ralph 2 with the bunny. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Toriyama's just, oh, 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 so full of grilled cheese. And Toriyama explodes, leaving to Toyotaro to be the sole leader of Dragon Ball. Uh, yes, no, according to plan. <laughs> No, you can't. No, that's why we're running. I mean, you could, but it's they'll take too. I don't wanna. Hey. 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 How's it going? I'm doing fine. <laughs> How about that weather and the sports team that played? <laughs> Yeah, they were pretty good, I guess. Oh, also, how are the wife and kids? <laughs> it's just a conversation. <laughs> oh, they are doing fine. <laughs> That's really great. I'm doing well. Please, don't do this. <laughs> that, dude, that guy is so, is such a bitch. Oh my god, it looks like a misunderstanding. <laughs> this is not main story. This is this is size 100% side mission. <laughs> yep. You punks are messing with the wrong girl. Launch has no ass. Yeah. She should get with Raditz. This what that's what always gets me about like like yes, when people draw sad. Dragon Ball Z you females like super attractively like with more curves because they always keep like the face <laughs> the normal design the rest yeah. of the way and I'm like this is weird this is like <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, like at least with like the dating Phantom stuff like I told you about like that weird one hot Sam fan f fan art that everyone uses in their fucking memes yeah um like at least it's in all in the style but like. The Dragon Ball, the Dragon Ball Z stuff, where they're like curvier, like the Preston ass are like super like not Dragon yeah. Ball style, but the faces. Yeah, it's just so like weird. <laughs> and it's like this isn't right. This is wrong. <laughs> like this is. Just, that's why like, like I know that like, you know the characters like, they can be sort of seen as attractive, but <laughs> I will never be able to look at the Dragon Ball Z females as fully attractive. You know, like, I can see, like, Android 18 is probably the closest. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but the rest of them all have the Toriyama eye style, which is, like... Kind of weird. Which is fine for Toriyama's art style, but it's not fine for porn. <laughs> <laughs> it's just, like... 
I mean, no, I have two figure. I have a Bulma figurine and a launch figurine made with the same people that have that curvy style. But <laughs> they have to sell the face. You know, like, this is weird. Because also, my brain knows they're not that curvy. Yeah. It's just it's like, this is weird. At least, like, the Sword Art figures are all relative. I'm, I say that, but. I have a pretty big titty Asuna figurine <laughs> that is 100% not the size of Asuna's chest. <laughs> I feel like that's just every figurine in that one anime girl. Sometimes. There are the ones that are legitimately just a figurine of them that is just that. They're not sexualized. They're not like a bikini or something. They're in their, in their outfits, so it's not changed in any way. Yeah. I have those as well. Uh, <sighs> but, whew. Let's make sure the. Who the hell are you? You're pretty tough for a pint The sin on one from SAO isn't that adjusted that I put when I have. Although no, <gasps> they made her tits bigger. Wait, how do you know my dad? <laughs> I feel like it's the worst with fucking One Piece girls. Oh yeah. Yeah, the, like Nami and Robin. Like it's always like here? so pronounced. Oh, dude, dude, that's it's so funny whenever it's like, yo, Nami's so hot. Meanwhile, Nani, Nani, I'm back on the little stage. I just get mad again. It just goes from zero to 100 from saying Nani on I. Just Nani, Nani. You have shit days! No, um. Wow, I really brought a full circle from like the second part to the first of this session. Um. No, but Nami, like, everyone's like, Nami's so hot. I'm like, she's all tan. She's all curved. It's just boom. Yeah. Boom. That's it. And then long neck. Yeah. Long neck. Daisy Dukes makes a What? I was told she has blue hair. Hold on, let me sneeze. <laughs> I got this feather in my pocket just for this. Imagine if Bulma made like a sinus controller thing for launch. So she could just transform. <laughs> That'd be pretty cool. <laughs> and then launch goes to the tournament. Of <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> she walks in with an SMG. Launch is the first Super Saiyan. She walks in with an SMG to the tournament of battle. All right, Jiren, come here. <laughs> he just gets shot in the fucking what? eye and dies. Oh, shit. Remember how the Zeno were there, like, I could finally hey, where he lives. no outside items <laughs> brought into the tournament. <laughs> and, then, and then the Batara came in and they're like, that one's fine, it's cool. <laughs> he keeps jumping all over the place for his training. Yeah. Oh, I see. And it's like some. I remember like something else I happened too, where they were like, "That that's fine. It's cool. I guess yeah. it's cool." I fucking love Zeno. Such assholes. <laughs> it's a, another Toriyama. Isn't character. that against the rules? No, no. It's fine. <laughs> no, no. He's got a point. <laughs> no, the one Zeno is just like. No, no. It's cool. But isn't that against the rules? No, no. He's got a point. <laughs> <laughs> no, to, like, remember I said King Yemba is a very Toriyama character? Zeno is a yeah. very Toriyama character. Yeah. Simple design. God of everything is a child. <laughs> yeah, that's Toriyama. That's textbook Toriyama. It's textbook Toriyama, man. <laughs> I'm sad the Toriyama bot isn't anywhere in this game. Oh, that's kind of sad. I'm kind of surprised. I mean, at least I haven't heard anything. This is a really rare Easter egg. I mean, it would be. <laughs> like, it's a that would be Tori bot. Small little Toriyama bot. Like, that'd be great. You know what Tori bot's like official name is? What? The God of the Dragon Universe. <laughs> That really makes that panel where he's just chilling on one of the palm trees at Kami House. <laughs> really, like, he's just like, I'm always watching. And he's only interacted with one Dragon Ball character. And it was Krillin. <laughs> Why do you do this? I don't know. I feel my lips are dry and I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> Guys, it's the only good part of Rise of Skywalker. Is this fucking... 
What are you talking about? Launch came back not too long ago. <laughs> huh? Wait, but oh, did someone call for me? Hi, Lunch. What? Oh. And Toy of Taro just like I'm not even gonna ask him anymore. About. You're Goku's son, right? It's a pleasure to meet you. My name's Launch. Have they ever actually met? You're Launch. But the mm. one I met before had. She was at Bulma's birthday party. Oh, uh, that's the other yes. me. At least in Battle of Gods. In the background. <laughs> Where she belongs. People tell me my personality changes. In the same place I that Puar and Oolong were. And my hair turns In the background. Oh, yeah, like, Launch has a little bit of tit. <gasps> but no ass. Changes. <laughs> Hard to believe, Does she right? work for the Red Ribbon Army? I think it might be some sort of condition she's I the leader. Have. She's got the Red Ribbon. <gasps> the OG that Red Ribbon. The oh, God. It's the other launch's That's profession. That would be earlier. such a twist. Sorry about that. That's how. That's the the next arc after Moro is the new Red Ribbon Army arc, and it's led by Blonde Launch. I really hope the other me didn't cause you too. I'd be okay with that. And every now and then, when she, she sneezes, the other launch tries to help them destroy the new Red Ribbon oh, Army, only no. to sneeze and then turn on them again. Oh my God! That would be awesome. That would be the best joke you. ever. <laughs> That would be such a good way to bring the joke back, is that every every time they're about to win, she sneezes and she fucking just does it again. It's just another back and forth, like the fucking Goku Black arc. Yeah. When I came to, I was near West City and I had no clue what was going on. And so I decided to come here. Uh, I like that Goku Black gave... Trunks such oh, bad PTSD that when he saw the he, when he saw Goku, the Goku he was trying to get back to <laughs> to get him to, to get his help, he fucking panics and punches him in the face. It's the least I could do. Yeah. Wanting to try out a few recipes for a while now. They really framed yeah, Goku Black to be idea. like really fucking cool, together. and then it just went to shit. Okay. Yeah. Like, he was okay because like like I said, that's the backstory scene where you see what he did to Goku's life is kind of awesome but then again everything else is like eh. and rose concept... was rose was neat yeah like the idea of a god tapping into super saiyan form but like not really sorry king kai <laughs> no i really i really really like the concept and even the character of zamasu and you know by extension goku black yeah I just, it, like, it really does just feel like halfway through, they were like, shit, what do we do? Yeah. I will say, I really like that they brought back Vegito. Yeah. I, I didn't like that they decided the Patara just wasn't forever. Canonically. Yeah. At least for non-Kais. Yeah. Doesn't explain how Supreme Kai could beat us, but, uh, but <laughs> you know. But, uh, you know, convenience. Uh, yeah. But, uh... Yeah, like, I was just like... Like, it's like, that was the whole point of the Patara fusion. Like, this is forever. Yo, like... What if when... Kabito and Kaioshin fused... Beerus and Whis fused? <laughs> Dude, I would love to see a Beerus and Oh, there's fusion. Oolong. And Poir. Well, bye. And um, Gohan! And Steven! And <laughs> Steven! Ah. Hello? Hi, Bulma. I had to look over the box. I'm like <laughs> slanted so much. Oh, Gohan. What? What brings you here? No. Why is it Eeyore? <laughs> no bother. Oh, I was just in the area and thought I'd stop by. I see. So does that mean you've got some time? Don't I'm mimic me. <laughs> it's me. I've got a small favor to ask you. That's that's rude. <laughs> no, that was your voice in the big green dub. Yata. She just punches the camera. She, oh God! You see it like fall over. Ah, <laughs> oh, Jesus! <laughs> Remember that brute Raditz? I was hoping you could bring me some parts for his space pod. 
And I kind of thought you could buy him some parts from his face. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> oh my god, boy. <laughs> now I have dinner. <laughs> you mean my dad's brother? You know, my uncle? You mean my dead uncle? <laughs> yeah, I remember him. He's the one that kidnapped me. I mean, he's not the only one that kidnapped you. Piccolo also did that, and that turned out fine. Sort of. Yeah, more or less. <laughs> right! I know it might judge up some bad memories for you, but I need some parts from that space pod. That hunk of junk is sporting some alien tech way more advanced than what we've got here. I've asked some people at Capsule Corporation to bring what they could find, but it's not enough. Okay, so you want me to find anything they might have? This <laughs> I just looked at myself in the webcam footage. <laughs> I just look so done. <laughs> this is bring it back to you. <laughs> this is shit you, you didn't see before, but we get tired. Yeah. You know, you're a lot better at understanding others than your father. Okay. <laughs> All right, I'll be back. East River. I think that's what they named canonically in the world. <laughs> He's in the East Ravine area. <laughs> oh, wow. Wow. <laughs> it's a Owen Wilson and Dragon Ball universe. Ah, uh, Iris is to go even further be one. It's just becoming Peter Griffin. <laughs> hey, Lois, you remember that one time that I went even further beyond? What's <laughs> 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 up? The whole room starts to shake. He's <laughs> <laughs> too fast. I can see a village. Wonder what's there. That was the shit that they really let let go of when um when Gohan was in high school and he got mad and the entire fucking classroom shook. Yeah. And I'm like, man, you could have done some good shit with that. Yeah. Granted, I actually really like the Gohan high school stuff. It is pretty good. <laughs> the teddy bear underwear really gets me, man. Just because the entire episode is just, I know your secret! And he's like, uh, no you don't! <laughs> She's just like, yeah, I do, I saw it with my own eyes! Uh, uh listen, we don't have to talk about it here. You wear teddy bear underwear! <laughs> what? <laughs> uh, uh, uh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you got me. But then he's still embarrassed because of that. <laughs> I give credit to Kylo Bear. His adult Gohan is iconic. Yes. <laughs> I hope when they eventually bring back Super for the anime that they do more of this Gohan. Yeah. Oh, well, looks like the moral arc is doing a bit more. That's good. He's, he's I, I want to see him really go through an arc. It was really funny when Gohan <laughs> they they brought back Ultimate Gohan in literally half an episode. Yeah. <laughs> God damn it. I'll be honest, I teared up a little. I thought it was cool, but it was more of just like, well, already? I teared up a little because I was like, finally! Yeah. <laughs> finally, Gohan's not just a I did like loser. seeing that like he legitimately lost it and he had to and he had to go through Super Saiyan and shit again. Yeah. Which was neat because we haven't seen like Goku Gi Super Saiyan adult Gohan. Yeah. Also, like, I feel like if they legitimately went through an arc of Gohan, like, growing mm -hmm. and, like, becoming, like, what he wa what he once was, I feel like that would make up for Gohan being so lame for so long. I also, Bo, I also just like that the signature only way to know he's ultimate Gohan is the one piece of it. Yeah. <laughs> it's the single thing. I'm like, that's fucking great. That's so Toriyama. <laughs> like... He just becomes Superman. He's just like, so do we do we design Ultimate Gohan any differently? <laughs> All right. Uh, great. <laughs> uh, okay. He also has the Spider-Man effect where he just doesn't need glasses anymore. <laughs> He's like, now I am stronger. 
and only strong pe only weak people need glasses. <laughs> oh my god. Beep, beep, beep. Beep, beep, beep. A lot of these songs were like better in the show when they were only played for the scenes they were played in. Yeah. But in this game, it's like they're looped for like half an hour of you playing, and it's like. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Frieza's gonna bow to the U.S. <laughs> the, the, fr bow to the U.S. <laughs> wow. Right. Trump finally did it. <laughs> he, even Frieza kneels under The Space under Force him. finally did it. It's the Trump Force now. Holy crap. I hope the space. I hope Trump's space force is not the first thing that discovers alien life and gets us is. killed. I hope it is. <laughs> that would be pretty fucking sweet. <laughs> Look at them. They think they'd be the smallest. They think the Kim Jong stuff, and then it's just the fucking. <laughs> the next shot is <laughs> the alien pulls out a ray gun <laughs> in the next photo. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Dude, aliens, man. <laughs> They're just gonna kill us on sight. That'd be pretty funny. Who needs something? Someone needs something. Oh, this happened to me, too. Where it was just like... There's a side mission somewhere, but it's not telling me. Going to the main hall? Into the garden? <gasps> Into the garden. That's baby. And we can too. <laughs> uh, let me. Maybe it's Bulma again? Let me leave and come back because she's like in the computer room. In the computer room? <laughs> no. Find the computer room. I don't want to find it. Find it. Go find the computer room. You're gonna die. I am. I'm breathing in all that. Keep Big keep fat Koro. Big fat cock. That's literally. That's what. That's what we have to call it to avoid. Yeah. Getting taken down on YouTube. Excuse me. That was me. Oh. It was Mike talking Your to phone me. Phone party. <laughs> There's Mike talking to me. He's like, I washed Bubba today. <laughs> this is what Quartz is. I washed Bubba today. I washed oh, Bubba today. Wow, could you, could How'd that go? <laughs> Detailed <laughs> describes it. <laughs> Clean. Oh, God. I'm a lean, clean fucking machine. <laughs> what are you, fucking Danny Tanner? <laughs> Ah, uh, I, I gotta go out and rewatch all of Full House now. See, I was right. It is. It was Bulma. I had to make her move. <laughs> Get into position for the side quest. Uh, what? What? Yeah, just fucking go. It's side mission shit. Yeah. How about you suck my dick oh, and that we can eat pussy till we die inside? Let's see. <sighs> Yata? <laughs> Pomo, why do you keep doing that? <laughs> God, this is the second okay. camera you broke. <laughs> now Mark was made. It's just someone out in the Eastern Union like... <laughs> the marker. It's right here! <laughs> X marks the spot! <laughs> Hell yeah, big B! <laughs> oh, you said big B. I am 100% going on Hulu when I get home and re watching Dead Declassified. Hey, big B! I am 100% doing that. Hey, dude. Ned, big B! Holy shit. Today? 
It just loads to a dead Gohan on the ground. Oh my god, that's creepy, boss. Oh no! I shrugged it off as a glitch. <laughs> and I tried to move on. <laughs> I tried to move on with my life after that nightmare. <laughs> it's so funny when they say that, because I'm like, if I ever see that happen to me in a game, I will literally flip, <laughs> flip my shit, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. If I was playing a 100% normal-ass Sonic game, and it just happened... I would not be able to just shrug it off. Like, I'd be like, oh, ah, 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 why? <laughs> and then I would have to go to therapy. <laughs> I hate those fucking little shits. Yeah, I hate them. Because I never noticed them until I've beaten everything else. I'm like, why is it done? Oh. Uh oh. I actually won. Fucking pop a smurf over there. I'd pop him right between the eyes. Uh, Cyberman. Like, how did they just? How did they palm? Like, where did they come from for these side missions? I don't know, man. <laughs> like, they had to literally have a bottle and plant the seeds in the sand saga. This is the same thing with like whenever I, me and my brother try to pitch to each other like what could make another like off-brand Dynasty Warriors game. You know, like how Gundam did it. Yeah. Like, Gundam was a stretch because, like, the mobile suits in Gundam weren't mass-produced that much. So to have that many of them in a fight is insane. Yeah. But, like, you know, Zelda made sense because Bacob, like, an army of Bacob and one that makes sense. But, like, anytime you think of a game, it's like, you can't do Dragon Ball Z because there's only a handful of times where there's a full army of people. Yeah, it's like for a Dynasty Warrior setup. Well, I mean, I guess like Saiyan Saga could be Cybermen, Frieza Saga could be Frieza Soldiers, and Cell Saga could be Cell Juniors. But that's again a big stretch because there was there specifically was only set like imagine Cell shitting out a million Cell Juniors. Oh God! <laughs> Just uh, <laughs> so many is that? Oh, oh God! They keep coming. I can't stop. <laughs> <laughs> it hurts. <laughs> oh, there's some blood on that one. Yeah. <laughs> Make it sound. It's just crying. It's just... <laughs> I've got nothing left. <laughs> Please. Please have mercy. <laughs> That's how they beat Cell. It's just... <laughs> oh, God. He finishes, they all finish coming out. And he's just super thin. <laughs> like anorexic. <laughs> I've given everything I have. My money. My fame. I have one subscriber. My dignity. No. They can't have that. I didn't have that in the first place. At least I could have been. Boo -ba -doo -ba. Hooray! We did it. And with that... Oh, like, no. this type of music... This song was specifically usually played during, like, credit. Like, like, like next episode stuff. You only hear it for five seconds. Speaking <laughs> now of it's which, on loop for, like, ten minutes. Speaking of which, this is where we're going to end it for today. Guys, if you liked the video, like it, comment, subscribe if you want to see more videos like this one. And hit that bell notification if you want to see other series such as Dream Daddy or Sonic 2. Uh, question of the day... Uh, Deb? <laughs> no. Put that shit in the comments. No, it's not the question. Question of the day. Um, what's your favorite Dragon Ball Z music? Put that shit in the comments below. I'm Bottles. I'm Pete. Peach. Continue.